25 years ago, I was looking for a job in the field of dairy science, and there happened to be an opening here at South Dakota State in the academic arena, and I was interested in, in teaching and research. 25 years later, I think I made the right decision, and, and that's because South Dakota State has just a very powerful dairy science program, and I'm glad I'm a part of it now. This program incorporates dairy production, which is the cow side of the program, as well as dairy manufacturing, which is the processing side. So in other words, it, it, it covers the entire spectrum of the dairy industry within one program. And secondly, we've got excellent faculty members who have been leaders in research and teaching. Our alumni have become leaders in the industry and have shaped the industry as we see it for the last 50 years or so. Valley Queens had a long involvement with South Dakota State University. We have eight SDSU grads on, on staff with uh, dairy manufacturing degrees. You know, they're, they're just tops. And now with the new plant they've got, uh, you know, we, we expect their uh, technological understanding to be much improved. A lot of the people that are teaching there come from industry, you know, and when I was there, my advisor spent a few years working for Kraft and had uh, really had hands-on knowledge of what it takes to succeed in the industry. So not only are you learning, you know, the, 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 the science and everything behind the dairy products, you're also learning first-hand knowledge of what it takes to, uh, to put those things to work on the plant floor and in, in that plant environment. Everybody wants to succeed out of STSU, and it's a, just a great program to, to kind of catapult you forth in your career. The SDSU Dairy Manufacturing Department is very unique. There's only a few universities in the entire United States that have an actual dairy manufacturing program where they are specifically looking at food science through the lens of dairy. When we look at people specific to the dairy manufacturing side of things or specific to microbiology, um, you can definitely tell that people from SDSU are coming in with a strong background in the sciences and the things that they're gonna need to succeed, especially in a company like Davisco. When I started working in the plant, one of the things that just was immediately obvious to me was the work ethic of the students. And it's no wonder that they're so successful. It's no wonder that companies come to SDSU for hiring students. Every fall we will have at least 20 companies coming in to interview us. And it's really competitive too amongst us and amongst them because the food industry is growing so we're always in demand. I think I've been prepared for my career very well. Just with the experience that I had in the plant, um, I worked there for about four years. I've been really into ice cream ever since I started this program and um, I just got together with my advisor and another professor and we kind of discussed what I could do and they said, well, why don't you make an ice cream flavor? Okay, I'll do that. And the flavor is actually hot chocolate ice cream and it's a blend of like chocolate with marshmallow revel and like different kind of spices plus a little pinch of cayenne in there so you get that kind of kick of heat. It's gotten this far that it's actually selling up at the dairy bar right now currently and hopefully it'll get famous. <laughs> What's the mission of our university? As President Chiquin would say, is to be nationally distinct and locally relevant. The level of interest from the dairy industry in the United States and the dairy farmers that have come onto this campus to help build this facility uh, to train students. Something that it's already done is attracted a large cheese company, an international cheese company, to Brookings. Just think about the impact it has not just on us, but on the community as a whole. Uh, it's going to hire 400 people, not just dairy people, but at all walks of life. You know, we're already uh, hearing from equipment manufacturers, already hearing from uh, uh, employers. And so I think the impact is, is huge. It's beyond what we imagined.